welcome back to my channel it's your girl faith back with another video so today we are doing a first customer video and this young lady is actually getting um her first set of knotless box braids and here i'm just applying a molding gel so that we can you know make the lines nice and neat and slick and yeah to make sure that it's straight as well so i'm using this molding gel over here and it smells so nice like it smells edible honestly i don't even know how that could be but it smells so nice but now i'm just twisting the two strands that are left over from the three that i'm doing at the back and then i'm just going to start braiding the other um the other box sorry i got distracted but yes before i start braiding i also just put the molding gel around the edges there just to also like make it slick and neat make sure i cover all the edges and then i just comb it through so that it can be distributed nice and evenly so that i can braid it nicely and it would just like you know not have any flowers when i braid it so yeah we could see that i started braiding a hair and after say braiding it for one or two two to three times i start adding my fiber and then i don't stop until i get my desired width or thickness um it depends on what you guys want to call it and then i just continue braiding down from there and then i just continue doing this throughout the whole process and yeah if you guys notice i do use two methods of braiding i use the normal one that we use like when it's cornrows and then the other one i don't know what these braiding styles are called but you know yeah, I'm just using these two different ones. It's more comfortable for me. But if you want to go one way all the way down, that's up to you. And if you want to use both, it's okay. There's so many different ways of actually braiding here, to be honest. So, yeah. This is just me adding the hair now to the braided part that I have just braided. And then I just continue doing this until the end. Enjoy the rest. <laughs> just going to show you guys how i actually start off my braid and this is without the fiber this is with her own hair and then after like i said two to three times of braiding her hair i then only start adding my fiber and i add the fiber from the bottom so that it doesn't like you know show that i added fiber if that makes sense but yes it 
it works for me, but there is other ways. I've seen people doing it differently, and I honestly get confused. So I just experimented with this one, and it clearly works. just always make sure that her hair is completely detangled so i will start from the bottom to the top by um with a comb and i just like comb out any knots that she might have um because she doesn't really like taking care of her hair she doesn't treat her hair so i suggested that she does some protein treatment i will be making a video of me treating my hair with um the protein treatment that i use um and then yeah and i just told it would you know lessen the breakage and so forth and yeah she also has like very dry skin so i'm going to speak more on that in another video I'm not sure when though but i hope it's soon um but i know apple cider vinegar works and aloe vera works but if you don't have that, just try to find products like hair foods and stuff um, that does have aloe vera or just something that will make like your hair nice and healthy and strong, you know. Like on her hair, before I started braiding it, I did use black chick um, hair food. It also like softens and you know make sure that it's like manageable it's actually a treatment but it's a hair food it's a hair food treatment yes so i just put that on before i started braiding her hair and her hair was a lot more manageable and softer um yes so this is how the hair food looks and i literally have a bigger tub like you know I don't know, if you live in South Africa and you go like to those black hairdressers, we know that they have those huge tubs. Yeah, so I have one of those. Um, it kept me like over a year now. I'm not even sure if it's healthy. But anyway, yeah, I'm sure it didn't expire yet. I must go check though. But it kept me well over a year and I'm still using it and is still doing its thing, you know.
Come on, baby. One more time. Okay, so I'm tying it here at the end because she originally wanted this style but at the end she told me that she would like me to braid her hair all the way to the end so we had to change and it took a bit longer than we were planning on you know having it be <music> So in the front here, we separated it into two parts and within each of those, we had four rows as well. Um, <clears throat> sorry. Yeah, we had four rows and yeah, I don't know how many boxes I made, but it came out nice. It came out very nice. But yes, now here I'm just making sure that the lines are straight. And that we have, you know, really neat lines and rows or whatever you want to call it. But yes, so um, in the front, I will always make sure that the edges are also like, you know, tucked in or laid nicely. Just so that I can look neater and cute, you know. Yeah. She's so beautiful, man. My friends are beautiful, guys. Yo. But yes, so... Then I'll just start braiding after combing it through. And yeah. yeah. I'm just going to show you guys carefully again how to do it. Well, not carefully, but you know. I'm just going to zoom.
last part she told me that she's actually very impressed because um her head is not hurting or anything and she didn't flinch once which i've noticed myself she told me that it's the first time her head her head didn't like you know hurt when people work on it so i guess that's a good sign <laughs> but yes um at the end here i didn't really record like how it looks at the end but i did put pictures so yeah so just enjoy me braiding her hair and then view the pictures at the end but yeah before i go please do not forget to like comment and subscribe share with your friends tell your friends that i do hair now mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but yes um like comment and subscribe don't forget to post um put on your post notifications and yeah, enjoy. See you guys. Mwah.